Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with Xcode. Our viewer is curious about how to refresh their provisioning profile after adding new devices, especially since Xcode 8 automatically manages signing assets. They mention that they've manually added the device in the portal and edited the provisioning profile, but Xcode isn't re-downloading it. Let's dive into this issue and explore some solutions together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you find that resolution. Now, let's continue on to the video. To refresh your provisioning profile in Xcode 8.3 or 9.0 after adding new devices, start by opening Xcode and navigating to the preferences. In the Accounts tab, select your Apple ID and then choose the team associated with your app. This will allow you to manage your provisioning profiles. Next, click on the Manage Certificates button. This will ensure that your certificates are up to date, which is essential for provisioning profiles. Now, return to the main Xcode window. Select your project, then go to the General tab. Here, you can check if the provisioning profile has updated. If the profile hasn't updated, you can manually refresh it by clicking on the Download Manual Profiles button in the Signing and Capabilities section. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To add devices to your provisioning profile in Xcode 8.3 or 9.0, simply build your app on the device. Xcode will automatically add the device's UDID and refresh the provisioning profile for you. However, if you don't have physical access to the device, you'll need to switch to manual management for devices and profiles. And that's it guys. I hope the video has helped find that resolution that you're looking for. And if it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time you need a technical video, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.